Hey, what's going on guys? It's Enoch Madrid here back with another video. And on this one, I'm excited to share because something came in the mail today and it's the, here it is, dun, 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 the new Mac mini, the M1 version. Check it out. Been excited. I've been waiting for this thing to come in the mail. So in this video, I'm going to be talking about why I decided to buy this thing and my reasons. All right, let's go. So before we get started, I want to share with you what my current computer setup is and what I use on a day to day basis. I've been using this computer for about three years now. It's the 2018 um, 15 inch MacBook Pro. I mean, this this machine is badass. Like it's 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 a workhorse. It's a 32 gigabyte MacBook Pro and it's the Core i9 2018 version. But I have my reasons why I decided to switch. I want to give it a try. I don't know if I'm going to like the Mac mini, but I mean, from watching all these videos and reviews, I decided to pull the trigger. So the number one and main reason why I decided to purchase this is because of the speed. Now, me as a UX designer, I work with heavy sketch files. I mean, we're talking about pages upon pages of an entire design system where I have like different files and different pages within a file with so many different components, all integrated, all talking to each other into a design system. And I also use abstract. It's a version control system for design files for sketch files. And that allows me to track, you know, what changes I make and then allows me to collaborate with another designer who uploads and creates branches. It's kind of like a GitHub workflow that developers use, but for designers in the current computer that I have, I, like I kid you not, this thing like freezes sometimes. And sometimes I have to make presentations on zoom. And then that eats up all the RAM and then I have Chrome running and then sketch files and sometimes even Photoshop and all these things. It slows down my computer. Now, like this computer has like 32 gigs of RAM, but I don't know. I want to give that a try. I want to like push it to the limit on the new Mac mini to see how it stands, you know, how it holds up on using all this power. So. That's the main reason why I bought it. And number two is because now that I started doing a lot of YouTube videos, uh, you know, I'm going to be doing more video editing. And every time I edit on Adobe Premiere Pro, it crashes on me. And so I want to make that switch to Final Cut. So that's that's reason number two. And, I'm, you know, from what I hear, it's very fast. And I mean, it's, the you know, Apple designed these soft software to work together. So that's my other reason. All right. So what we're going to do now is to unbox it. And I'm excited because I really want to get to start playing around with this machine. All right, let's go. All right. So here it is. Let's open up this bad boy. This is the 16 gigabyte RAM with 512 SSD. All right, let's open up this guy. Man, I can't wait. Ooh. Well, I'm not going to be so careful with this thing. Let's just rip it all apart. That's more fun this way. <laughs> Check this out. Look at this bad boy. Let's see on the back. is off. Throw this away too. Ooh, look at this. Let's see, I just gotta peel this off. Nice. I got 
this stuff go this way too. All right, so here we have the, the power button. That's for electricity or ethernet, two Thunderbolt connectors, HDMI, and two USB ports in your audio jack. Now, uh, this is not a full review. I know there's a lot of people out there that make better videos for those things, but we'll see how this goes. I'm gonna try it out. This U Mac Mini, hopefully I can work faster, just bigger files, doing UX design. We'll see, we'll test it out. It's not a full review, but you know, it's, it's mainly for work. I hear good things about it. Um, I'll see if I can do a small review after this. Well, there you have it guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. It's really quick, I know. But on the next one, I'm going to share with you my thoughts on what I think, you know, the performance is like. I'm going to test that big sketch file. I'm going to set it all up and give you guys a review on it. All right. I'll talk to you in the next one. Peace out.